The total farmland controlled by Ukraine's 10 largest agricultural farms has remained nearly the same since 2021 and stands at 2.65 million hectares. For those of you who don't know, and to put things into perspective, just one hectare is equal to 1,000 acres. As you're about to see, these farms produce a variety of agricultural products, so stay tuned and don't go away because we're revealing the largest farms in Ukraine. First up, where does most of the world's sunflower oil come from? Let's take a look. Ukraine's Colonel Farm is the world's leading source of sunflower oil, Ukraine's largest producer and exporter of sunflower oil, and a major supplier of agricultural products from the Black Sea region to international markets. Colonel exports its products to more than 80 countries around the world, and since November of 2007, the company's shares have been traded on the Warsaw Stock Exchange. Colonel had a total of 530,000 hectares a year ago, and now that number is down to 510,000 hectares. But business on the farm is still booming. Another massive farm in the Ukraine is Euchre Land Farming. A year ago, the farm had 500,000 hectares and is now down to 475,000 hectares. Euchre Land Farming is responsible for crop production, meat, milk, and the production of eggs as well. Euchre Land Farming operates thousands of hectares of Ukraine's fertile cropland and is committed to promoting the country's agricultural sector. The farm works side-by-side -side with landowners, partners, suppliers, public authorities, local communities, and other organizations to strengthen than Ukraine's food security. The farm prides itself in taking good care of the land and implements innovations to help communities prosper. They use equipment by the world's top manufacturers, grow grain, produce eggs, milk, and meat, and process them into various products used for both human and animal consumption. Euchre Land Farming supplies its home market and exports to more than 40 countries all over the globe. They feed their animals with innovative feedstuffs that they produce themselves and dispose of waste in a responsible and environmentally sustainable manner while educating farmers on how to use farming waste as fertilizer. Next up, which farm in the Ukraine has a massive amount of chickens? Let's find out. Ukraine has more than 200 million chickens, and of those birds, most of them can be found at Yuri Kosiuk's MHP Farms. The 375,000 hectare farm is responsible for crop production, livestock production, poultry production, meat processing, and biogas production. For those of you wondering, wait, what's biogas? In short, biogas is a gaseous fuel, especially methane produced by the fermentation of organic matter. In this case, organic matter means decomposing animal feces and manure. MHP is the largest producer and exporter of chicken in the Ukraine, so it's safe to say there's a lot of clucking going on at MHP farms. The company not only specializes in the production of chicken, but the cultivation of cereals as well as other agricultural activities. MHP also manufactures meat, sausage products, and various other ready-to-eat meat products. Today, MHP is not only the leading producer of chicken in the Ukraine, but the leading producer of poultry meat in all of Europe and has one of the strongest food brands in Ukraine. MHP is also one of the largest grain producers in Ukraine, with a significant potential for additional growth and is the largest producer of Ukraine's meat processing market. I don't know about you, but all of this talk of chicken is making me want to go out and grab a bucket of extra crispy. Anyway, let's move on to another massive Ukrainian farm. It's called Agroprosperous, aka New Century Holding. Agroprosperous is a 300,000 hectare farm and its main activities are the the production of grains and oil seeds. Agroprosperous is a New York-based NCH's agribusiness portfolio company in Ukraine. Founded in 2007, the company is among the largest producers and exporters of agricultural crops in the Black Sea region. In addition to producing its own crops, Agroprosperous provides local mid-sized and small crop producers access to its scale through its intricate network supply chain operations and offers financing options, input purchasing, crop storage, and distribution. Up next, which Ukrainian farm produces produces the most sugar, milk, and beef, you're about to find out. When it comes to Ukrainian sugar, milk, and beef production, Astarta Kiev is the reigning king. Astarta Kiev's main production activities include crops, sugar, and dairy products, livestock production, and like MHP Farms, biogas production. Astarta Kiev is one of the largest vertically integrated agro-industrial companies in all of Ukraine. The farm has roughly 220,000 hectares under management and is the number one producer of sugar in the entire country. Processing and estimated 36,000 sugar beets per day in eight sugar factories. Astarta Kiev is also the number one producer of milk and cattle, with over 22,000 cows. Astarta Kiev is also Ukraine's number two producer of soybean crushing and crushes 230,000 tons per day. As far as biogas production is concerned, Astarta Kiev produces 150,000 cubic meters of biogas per day. Since 1993, the company has proven to be a reliable partner and supplier, committed to the highest international 
national standards for quality, innovation, and sustainability. The farm has also established long-term business relationships with leaders of the Ukrainian food processing and confectionery industry, and a growing part of the production is being exported through international agricultural traders to more than 30 countries around the globe. Astarta Kiev works with major international and local banks and has a perfect credit rating. Stay tuned and don't go away, because we're revealing everything you need to know about Ukraine's largest farms. Next up, how many french fries can you make with 106,200 tons of potatoes? Probably enough to feed all of Ukraine. A lot is going on one of Ukraine's largest farms called Continental Farmers Group. This farm uses 195,000 hectares to produce crops, potatoes, grain storage, and seed production. The lands of Continental Farmers Group are located in the most fertile and favorable regions in all of Ukraine. The agricultural holding farms 195,000 hectares of land in Ternopil, Lviv, Kimelnitsky, Chernivsky, and the Ivano-Frankivsk regions. The company's vast experience in agricultural production is combined with the use of advanced technologies, state-of-the-art equipment, agricultural machinery, and the efficient use of available natural and land resources. Continental Farmers Group is one of the leading producers of potatoes in Ukraine, which stores potatoes in modern potato storage facilities in the Chernobyl and Lviv regions with a total capacity of 106,200 tons of potatoes. That's a lot of spuds. The company also owns a starch manufacturing plant. The company possesses four grain elevators with a total capacity of 387,000 tons and three drying and storage facilities with a total capacity of 33,000 tons. Continental Farmers Group's largest elevators are located in Kozova settlement, in the city of Borshev, and in the village of Derenevka in Ukraine's Chernobyl region. More than 100,000 tons of corn, wheat, rapeseed, sunflower, barley, and soybeans are stored in these silos. Another cool thing that the farm does is produce its own seeds, and this has some very big advantages. The farm produces 420 tons of high-quality seeds per year, with the seed purity at 99.8%. By doing this, the farm reduces its independence on external suppliers, controls the quality of its products, and has the freedom to scale prices down if it chooses to do so. Up next, what's going on at Epicenter Agro? Let's take a look. There's a lot going on at Ukraine's Epicenter Agro farm. The 160,000 hectare farm's primary activities include crop, livestock, dairy production, grain storage, and flour and cereal production. The experienced team at Epicenter Agro not only manages more than 160,000 hectares of high-quality land, but it's a key player in crop production, with more than 1 million tons of elevator capacity, a state-of-the-art agrochemical laboratory for soil analysis, and a certified seed plant. The development of the agricultural direction of the Epicenter K group of companies began with the establishment of Agro Holding 2012 LLC, which was concentrated in the Kimilevsky region. One year later, however, the company expanded its farming facilities in Venezia, Kiev, Chernobyl, and the Cherkasy regions. Epicenter Agro is constantly seeking to aggressively expand its operations, and thus the company is evolving year after year. Moving on now to another farm that just keeps growing and expanding, we're talking about the Agrarian System Technologies, or AST company. The company began initially with roughly 110,000 hectares, but within a year expanded to 150,000. Its main focus is crop production, but it also operates several biogas factories as well. It's likely that in the coming years, AST will continue to expand and diversify its operations. Finally, what can you do with 127,000 hectares? The answer is a lot. Ukraine's Harv East farm uses its 127,000 hectares of high-quality fertile land for crop, livestock, and mixed fodder production, grain storage, and its very own seed production. It produces wheat, sunflower, corn, and pulses. Pulses are the dried seeds that result from various crop production activities. Harvest is also a dairy farm, seed producer, and has other general gardening activities, including home and garden plant sales. Lastly, Ukraine's IMC Farms uses 120,000 hectares of fertile land for grains, oil seeds, and dairy production. In case you are wondering how these farms acquire more land, it's pretty simple actually. Many of these companies will seek out private landowners and offer to buy their lands at market value or above. Sometimes, however, landowners don't want to sell because they want to pass the land down to their children. That's a wrap for today's video. Thank you for watching.